you with us, Sticky Fingers back again with another MRE review. Today we're going to look at a survival ration. Don't know much about this particular ration. I'm not even sure which year, what year was produced. Could be 1967, could be 1977. So, yeah, not much information. These were approved by the U.S. Coast Guard for use as lifeboat and life raft survival rations. They were also accepted by the Canadian Ministry of Transport. It's called a Neutro, nibble for nourishment, 32 ounces, roughly 2 pounds. So yeah, we'll get into this one and uh, check it out. Well, here it is. It's, uh, it's called Neutro, nibble for nourishment, between meal pick me up for active people, no preparation, over 3,700 energy calories, um, 32 ounces nibble for nourishment we've also got the contents and ingredients uh, malted milk tablets fortified biscuits cc pieces and chocolate crunchels so it should be interesting we've got a date code like i said i'm not entirely sure how old it is could be 1977 could be 1967 uh, could be older or even newer not entirely sure but yeah we'll get into it all right sorry about that it was a uh, pretty tough to open so oh man that is not good at all oh that stinks <laughs> wow We got this uh, massive piece of, I guess this is the chocolate crunchles. <laughs> that does not look good at all. Also smells uh, terrible. Guessing these are the uh, CC pieces, uh, chuckles. <laughs> it's fruit artificially flavored jellies from uh, Nabisco. I still don't see any kind of. Uh, date code we've got more of these <laughs> wow that is not it's not good at all Uh, chocolate discs this could be the fortified biscuits so this is probably more like bread yep that does not smell good it's <sighs> it just smells old it smells pungent you know wow you see that I'm not trying any of this just to let you guys know <laughs> That's it. These could be the fortified biscuits. Got holes everywhere. <laughs> there it is. <sighs> it 
this stuff smells rancid, so I will not be trying any of this. Let's take a look at this again. This kind of looks like. <laughs> Don't get who would eat this. Yep. Let's open this up. It's already kind of open. It's sort of like a gummy type of candy. You guys want to read that go ahead and give it a pause well I guess I'll um, I'll give one of these a try <laughs> here it goes surprisingly it's still pretty good this tastes like um like cola flavor, like Coca-Cola. That's actually not that bad. Let's try a red one now. Yeah, that's really that's pretty good. Tastes like um, cherry. Wow. It's actually still pretty good. Um, let's try the, the green one now. I'm guessing it's a uh, lemon or uh, lime. Yeah, that's lemon flavor. Yeah, these are still pretty good. Very surprised that's still good. There's also these which come uh, they're separate from the bag, but they're, uh, the name's still uh, Chuckles. This one's a little bit slimy. Yeah, I'll pass on that one. And here's one without any uh, labeling on it. We'll pass up on that one as well. <laughs> but yeah, that was the neutral. Um, well, that was the neutral. As you can see, everything's in pretty bad shape. Uh, these are no good. They're hard as a rock. I'm not trying them. That smells rancid and it has milk in it. So I'm staying away from that. That looks like it came out of an animal's uh, behind, so definitely not trying that. Uh, surprisingly, the chuckles were pretty good, so at least something good came out of this. Um, hope you guys enjoy the video. I'm giving this thumbs down. Again, thank you guys for watching, and uh, see you soon.
I'm sure some of this stuff was great when it, you know, when it was new. Unfortunately, time has uh, hasn't been too nice to it.